Hello, this is Diana from Artfully Yours, and um, here day 10 of the 14 day Valentine art challenge. Uh, I'm trying out for the first time spray, these are the spray water based inks with drops of alcohol, and I have a little spray mister of alcohol, rubbing alcohol 91 or 90 percent alcohol, and seeing what it does. And um, oh, yeah, I'm doing this on canvas board, and um, my, I really I love the spray inks. They have such in saturated colors. So you'll see I I do droppers. The droppers show up. The dropper of alcohol shows up better than the misting, which you'd have to have. I'd have to have a better close up. The misting makes a little speckled effect, and you'll see right now that the droppers make big. Yeah. There they go, the big uh, blooms of ink, not ink, but movement, making marks. It's just, I don't know how you call it, making marks, movement of the dye. And um, yeah, it, so I, I'm trying out, the, um, I'm trying with my cool colors first and being careful about what colors are next to each other because if you get two complementary colors next to each other, like red and green, you're just going to end up with brown when, where they mix. So I'm being, so I'm worked with the cool colors first, and then I'm, see, and then red and purple, that even though one's a cool color, one's a warm color, that's okay, because then you can, you just get red-violet, because those are not complementary colors, those are analogous colors. And, um, so... It was interesting to see how that, how this works, and um, it's the first time I've ever done it. And this is um, going to be a background for one of my uh, Valentine art pieces. And it turns out that the finished um, piece, just that background piece right there with all the inks on it, my husband really liked it. And he didn't really want me to even add anything to it. And so that's going to be his Valentine Day present. And um, so there with the yellow. So he likes it plain just like that. Even though that's not, you don't call that plain. But he doesn't want me to, I have a bunch of wooden hearts that I was going to be decorating. And I, I show in this video the option of adding the wooden heart painted gold. So there's the background, and it really takes a long time to dry overnight because there were pools of color that didn't even dry after an hour. So I, I had let that I let that dry overnight, and um, see if they they are spraying. I'm trying to still see. Okay, this is the next day, and that's the six inch wooden heart, and I'm. That was the placement of where I'm going to put it on the background. Here I am painting it with metallic gold paint. This is really excellent gold paint liquid. It's called liquid metal. Comes in and it's gold by Sargent, and it's it's a super great. It's it looks so metallic. It's great um, gold. I mean, you don't see it so much in this uh, video of how metallic it really is. Those are cute little Valentine stencils that I got. That I'm and I was trying to decide what colors to use for the stencil inside the. So I decided red and then all, everything red except for black. And so there I was, um, still playing with the. Well, I know playing with the placement. Now, well, I was thinking of adding these little. These things are not stickers they're not stickers there's organza ribbon that i'm going to be using but those black um doily things are they're not stickers and they're not stencils so and i didn't that didn't work i didn't i tried that out it didn't look so um here i the organza ribbon i'm seeing how i'm trying to make it into just a simple bow and um yeah, I didn't like that black thing. I was, and then I was thinking, what could go right in the center of the bow? And I did not like that black doily thing. And then I, um, then I was thinking of the oh, I have sticker gemstones, 
And um, I was trying to, I, you can take them off in rows. They stick together in a row. And I was trying to make a circle with them, but that didn't, I didn't like how that worked out either. So then, um, then yeah, then I, I, we have sparkly red wrapping paper and I cut a heart and I, that one, that turned out good. And um, so that turned out good for the center of the ribbon. So there it is, finished. And actually that, so that's an option for, a finished piece and that's painted in gold right yeah and um uh, so thank you for subscribing and please comment and like thanks for watching <laughs>